So yes, finally, finally, finally! Though of course, I'm back with it real quick, of course. So of course it was yeah back with another quick Dark Ball Legends video of course though but yeah uh, we got new info of course for um this new year right here so yeah we got new Ultra Kak and Goku actually we just was gonna make a short on it though of course though but um you know get it up though really quick though I just didn't have time I was really busy doing other stuff though so yeah of course though but yeah new info new news all this stuff of course though so yeah uh, new Kak and Goku's already a Legends and everything of course though uh, we got new animations on here again just going back and forth and everything of course though but yeah we got a new gameplay for the new mode that's coming up though it's crazy you had to swap like rough right. You gotta do this, you gotta do that. Uh, you gotta combine your attacks, punches, blast. It's utterly insane right now, though. Yeah, sorry about the video choking. It always checks out now. I don't know for Legends. I don't know why. I'm still gonna go play it, though. Go ahead. Because for some odd reason, it just does this. So, um. But yeah, though, of course, like I said, we got new info, new news, of course, like I said, though. So, yeah, actually, he's not the first new blast armor, though. So, yeah, like, after 500 years, we finally got rid of the blast armor gimmick, though. So, uh, yeah, though, of course. But yeah. Um, again, new news, new info, though, so of course, though, for Legends. So, yeah. Um,. Can I just go to the end? I just, yeah, I just keep going with that though. So yeah, of course. I can just skip. Can I skip? Okay, there we go. Um, because I don't know why, even why it's checking out. I've been doing this last couple of videos. I have no idea why. So I just, you know, go with that. Whatever. So I just, I'll just skip to the end. Let's just skip to the end. So yeah. And we'll bang. Go for Goku. Yeah, go. Cool. Yeah. I'll look at his animations, but whatever, whatever. Though. So of course, maybe. Yes, it is. Okay, it's just, okay. That's just the um, video file itself. I'm uh, doing that because we're doing that last couple of Legends videos. I have. I really no idea why it keeps doing this to me though, because it's just I don't know. It, just, it does this. So yeah, sorry about the animation not going fully through. Just I have no idea. It's just stupid at this point. So yeah, of course though. Um, but yeah, New Cal King Goku Legends again. Just so much info, so much stuff to go over. It feels like a dog of my video right now. But yeah. Um, we got a couple new things on here, of course, we got, say we got the new gameplay mode right here. Uh, just a new gameplay for the new mode coming up and everything, of course. Uh, swapping left, right, like I said. I'm um, doing different inputs and everything, of course. So many just different stuff. Just gonna, like, say, going back and forth and everything, of course. It's early, early crazy right now, so, um, yeah, just, again, just, just so much right now for Legends, like, it's crazy. A uh, good, like, the good stuff, like, you know, good stuff, but it's just utterly crazy right now, so. Uh, yeah, that's um, some of the gameplay right there. Um, do Kaku Goku. I'm gonna do Miguel's translation because he has um, he had the screenshot. But I was gonna screenshot it myself, but he already has all the info right here though, so it's pretty cool. Um, new background asset for the new mode. Um, now when you log in, you get stamps and stuff like that. Of course, every 14 days you get those Chrono Crystals which actually is pretty cool. About like two weeks, so yeah, like two a week, we get a half with Jexy, is not bad though. Or like every week, you have about a thousand Chrono Crystals. I don't know, do something like that. Be a little bit more generous. I mean, Legends is generous. They've been really generous. But this and last year, they gave a lot of crystals, and yeah, trust me. I mean, I played a lot though. I dig a lot of crystals as well though, so yeah. Uh, we got that little login and stuff like that. Of course, it's a couple of days. Uh, we got new raid, of course, it's typical stuff right there. We got um, the full power battle though. So for Jiren, it's split up. So Jiren, it is actually split up though. So for Jiren, you get blue Goku, and I think for um, blue, um, for blue Vegeta, you have to do fight Topo. So I think it's um, either or though. So, um, you know, like I said, it's just separate bosses because it's um, against both bosses. So, it doesn't make sense, you know, blue Goku. A blue, a blue Vegeta definitely does make some so that's really cool. Uh, we got the banner right here, I think. Yeah, the new banner. So, yeah, Rose is back again, like for like the second time. Blue and Blue Vegeta is still one of the best. I think Yellow LFs, for oh my god, still on there. I mean, this Goku is gonna be he's okay, like, he's pretty good. Like, it's just the way he came out. A lot of people like weren't satisfied with him just because you know, like, oh, yeah, it'd be um, Resurrection of Blue Goku, which would have been pretty cool because they oh, oh, like the opening intro animation starts off with that. Him, like, you know, the cracks from the um, Super Saiyan Blue form. I was like, oh yeah, he's gonna be Resurrection F, but sadly he is not though, so yeah. Yeah, of course, uh, we got um, Gogeta back as well though, so it's pretty cool. Um, as, well, did he come back already? I think no, it was him as a boss, one of the two. Uh, of course, we got his full kit up and everything, of course, though. We also got some more new stuff as well on here. Um, for the new update, it is right here. So yeah, we got just a lot of new stuff. The new Gaichu feature, the new full power battle mode, that's been officially called. Again, little stuff like that. Again, you fight get different bosses, so I mean, team up, do different um, combinations and stuff like that. Of course, Rising Rush still effects and stuff like that, of course. Uh, yeah, new full power, um, you know, like I said, the, you know, Blue Vegeta, Blue Goku, you get from well, both the bosses and stuff like that, of course. You got to function, so basically, you're battling and stuff like that, of course. Uh, for YouTubers, it's gonna be really, really good, but just because, um, in general, for YouTubers, because of, um, you could just record this and just, you know, watch a replay and stuff like that. Yeah, that team's gonna get demolished. But yeah, uh, yeah, that's, you think that team is fair? <laughs> for these free play squads, you think that's really fair? But yeah, um, really good for YouTubers because they can just, you know, do the footage. Um, it's gonna be actually to save a lot of time though, in general. I think the Legends knows that, like, just knows that in general because 
And this definitely is going to be a lot better, I think, in general, just because, um, legitimately, for YouTube, it's going to be really good because you can just sort of record this footage, talk about it, and just go through it fast, fast, small battles, whatever, but, um, still, like, I think, um, battles that, um, are, um, like, cut, like, you know, connection error and stuff like that do not count, though, so, you have to um, actually battle and stuff like that, which actually is pretty good, I mean, you just, you can't get that, because, you know, you're not going to battle, you can like, you win, but, yeah, I mean, you look at it, like I said, recording is going to be really easy, though, for this, because you, you can just have this in the background, and just record the footage, like, via, like, your screen recorder from your iPhone, or something goes for, um, Android as well, again, like I said, at least in the login um, system, like, say, get that on Chrome, I guess, every week, um, every two weeks, I think, you say every two weeks? Every 14 days, I said, two weeks, um, in the missions, I think in the menu now you can. I guess. Oh, player ID change. Oh. I guess it's easier to navigate through different modes and stuff like that, of course. Um, it's something nice to change your favorite character, like Dogen did, just get a cool bunch of the update where you can basically select your favorite characters. He has been with it though, for this, so yeah. yeah. It's easier for like the photos and stuff like that, of course. Yeah, A tier, yeah, B tier. Uh, rematch now, you can um, do that now. For, no, it doesn't do that. Okay, raids and co ops. Okay, so you can invite your friends. Eight guild members again. Takes that if free matches are allowed. I'll just do little updates, stuff like bugs and fixes. Turn the power reactor yeah, when the guy Goku. G is active. Yeah, this is a little update stuff. There's a lot in here. Holy crap. I didn't expect that though. So yeah, just a lot of different info in here as well. Though. Yeah, so we got Kaba, Hurika, like buff and stuff like that. Uh, let's see. Odin stuff. Yeah, dual coin equipment. Same shop that all got updated. My hero stuff update. Yeah, same shop. Modified button. What's the, there's just so much to read on here. That's why. There's, uh, kids, there's so much to find though. Uh, this is a banner, I believe. That is um, Kalkin the Equip that came out. Because ago, oh yeah, Calculo. Yeah, I was going over because um, a lot of people did into the banner, of course, right here. Um, but yeah, a lot of people were sad about that because of uh, <laughs> right here. Uh, a lot of people were mad sad about it because of uh, they want him. They want him to be this Goku essentially. A lot of people were mad about that. Like this Goku definitely is going to be older. Unit. I think he deserves that. Probably this because he only shows like on screen for like, a couple seconds and just get beat by Jiren in general, though. So. Yeah, that's still kind of messed up a little bit, though, in general, though, but, I mean, it's pretty okay. As, I mean, as an Ultra Unit game, he's pretty okay. He's, de he's decent. I don't want to say he's mid, but he's decent. Uh, again, for, like, Realm of Gods and stuff like that, if you really need that. If you're, like, a Realm of Gods main like me, if you need, like, that extra little punch, he's probably going to be the worth it to get. But otherwise, yeah, sadly, he's just, uh, just... Yeah, but in 2000, Z Power is still really good, though. But in general, though, yeah, sorry to say that about Goku, though. He's just... Just sadly, just in the realm of like, you know, he was hype, really good, mid, kind of, I don't know, just still stuff like that. that was cool, so. But yeah, now it's finally on this kit though, so it took forever to go over. So yeah, of course. Let's go over the boat. Um, but yeah, like I said, again, like I said, when he, um, because him as an ultra, I don't mind him as an ultra, but the other one could have been an ultra, and then a lot of people, I, I, again, I don't mind him being, uh, this guy being an ultra, you know, he's on screen for like two seconds, but him being an ultra, though, in general, it's not, it's not bad, it's, it's decently good, but yeah, I did pull up this translation just because it's a lot easier, I can just get everything done pretty fast, swap for back for tabs, but yeah, in general, though, like I said, um, a lot of people were so sad, slash mad about him, because he wasn't the, 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 this Goku, essentially, though, but, um, yeah. But, I mean, hey, we can't acquire for someone, but it could be um, Ultra or LF probably in the future. Or, you know, the yellow Zekai one. one. Got it, you know, the yellow um, one that came out, the very first one that came out for via Universe Sector 7. That one could have been, or the Temple Arc, as everybody calls it. That one could have been um, the, 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 this unit as well, though. So, yeah, again, a lot of people were size mad, so I'm sad about it, though. But, yeah, though, of course. But, yeah. Oh, uh, yeah, some hashtag some family. I'm done. Hashtag some family saying God key, uh, super sign God. I <laughs> like that, though. So, yeah. Um, that, that. Because the ability is at um, Z3, of course. Three, um, of course. Special move, damage afflicted for episode Universal Bob Saga S. And 38% of the episode um, Universal, Universal Bob Saga S. Or a God key strike, base strike, attack, and defense. Um, base strike, attack, and blast through defense during battle. Unique abilities while this character is on the battlefield of uh, rarely uh, epic. Really, I, I say rapidly. Oh, rapidly. I say rapidly. What? Well, when on the battlefield, his unique abilities when on the battlefield rapidly restores unique gauge according to key charge time. That's crazy. Once the unique gauge is full, it resets to zero and applies the following effects to self. Draws on, push your cards and X, restores health up by 50%, activates seven times, which is this green card basically, pretty much. Um, almost, which is insane. 40% to next um, strike. 
Strike costs damage and create inflict depth dam 80%. Same thing goes for blasts on damage as well. Then 20% special move as well up to 40%. Uh, reduces next damage sub um, substituted by 20%. Cannot be stacked. Pause up until the combo ends. Um, Hosoro's damage and gauge up by 100 by 5 times. So yeah, he's basically is going to low key on Frank. He can do that too, I think. So yeah. Just again, baiting, getting his green card healing is pretty much what he can do though. He did get ability again, apply his following effects to his character, evades an attack, with the vanishing step, increases on card draw speed on um, level by one. For 10 time accounts, randomly destroys one enemy card, inflicts enemy attribute um, to upgrade or oh, downgrade by 50% to key recovery for 15 time accounts. Uh, cover change against strike enemy, um, strike cards combo with special, um, oh, special um, moves. So what was his next one? What's his last one right here? His order ability if this character is the leader, plus fun effects to self and the um, battle starts. 30% the um, damage effect there um, can be cancelled, and 30% the character can be cancelled. Okay, that's pretty cool. I think it's really cool though. If this character is now a leader, plus fun effects to self per universal survival so like ask um battle slash support member when the battle starts, five percent to um if to damage inflict there, five percent to kill recovery, um up to thirty percent support members counted, blast all destroys all your enemies, special cards on hit. Okay, I think that's really good. He did some good stuff about him. Like his, his ultra ability is decently good. Um, his damage is flicked itself with that. Of course, like I said right here, it's gonna be um still pretty good as well. Even as a battle support member, it gets a little lower than this one, but it's pretty much the same exact thing though. This is just a little bit higher than this one. This is when the battle starts, and this is just you know as a regular support though, which actually still could be probably a little bit better because as an overall support, this will be decently good. But as a leader, he's decently good as well. Again, the universe of Bible Saga is just going back and forth this time. The duck is like, oh yeah, they did last two years, 2020, 2022, 2021. Let's do it here. So yeah, um, yeah, that's basically what I should doing. And destroying all your enemy special moves on hit, your boss cards, that's disgusting as well. I think that's pretty good. But it's really as much just go with Gita though, kind of like when I read this, like, um, or read, when I read the Vengeance game stuff, I was like, yeah, he's really is just go with Gita. I know people were slash, slash sad, slash mad, slash, you know, everything, of course, for this guy though. I mean, but I kind of do get it why everybody's just mad about this, just because it just, whatever. But I mean, he's good. He's decently good. He's pretty he's just kind of go to just with form of gods and some little stuff here and there. But he does some good stuff like the blast damage and like inflict dead, the strike blast, like for all the uh, his special moves and stuff like that. Of course, healing, ring card. Um, yeah, he's pretty just kind of go to just a little bit some extra stuff though. So yeah, probably gonna go in the video there for sure. Yeah, good hype unit. Just I guess a lot of after the hype just kind of died down a little bit. If you want something, you can go ahead and really for the Rumble God support. But he it's just he pretty much is just blue go to um, the blue Ultra one just super good. Yeah, just updated a little bit, so he's kind of like that though. You really don't need to summon those yet. See you guys there though. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great day. Quite a good though. So we'll see you guys there. Watch your hands. God bless all of you. Going out for a while. That's a little bit ready too. So quick though. So we got to think about all those of quick like to hate again. I think he's decently good. You don't have to summon for him. You easy to skip this. It's just that. Yeah, yeah, if you're looking for Roma Gods, you know you really need, he's worth it. But he really is just blue Ultra Gogeta in a nutshell, pretty much. Just some updated stuff here. You know, like he has Vanity Gage, like he does. He has healing, like he does on the screen card, but he does it a lot. Though. But yeah, he has a lot of Vanity, a lot of healing. He's unique gauge and stuff like that, of course, his key, his zero skill. He's decent, he's decent. He's not bad, but he's decently good. Like, and compared to all the free to play Ultras, like Omega, Gogeta, and Vegeta, yeah. And his animations are decent too, though. Um, again, his overall is pretty okay. It doesn't like, oh my gosh, Omega crazy, but what well, gives his universal survival side? His um, universal for a seven counterpart, which will honestly probably be LF at this point, or, or another Ultra, probably later in the future. I don't any damn now, though, but even the yellow one, the yellow one is that guy. He, that one's, I feel like they're gonna do that probably later, which will maybe go back to the comment. Um, but yeah, this one's decently okay. It's not bad, though, but yeah, they could have easily, easily, easily. Um, I don't know. I mean, I, I like the, you know, again, I love Calcum Blue uh, as a form, the power up, cool, all the double ores overlapping each other. I love the. I like it, but I mean, he's he's decently okay. Again, you really don't need to summon for this guy. His banner's really good, though. Like, legit, his banner really is. Um, good right here. Like, Gogeta Rose is so disgusting. Blue is so good. But I think um, if you're just going for that, Blue Vegeta is plugging better than this guy. I mean, Z Power Wise, whatever, though. But, I mean. Yeah, just he's pretty okay. Like nothing like I'm excited, but it's like the hype kind of died down like after like a while though. So yeah, that's what it kind of just feels like at this point though. But yeah, I mean he's pretty okay. Again, like they really don't need to summon for him though. Uh, honestly, just easy skip. Again, we are, we're gonna get if I pop into more normal guys banners like on the future anyway though. So um yeah though, gonna end it over sure. There, so yeah, he's 
Not mid, but he's decent. Again, he's just Blue Gogeta. Ultra Gogeta. I loved it. You have nothing really else to say though after that, just cause eh, whatever. So yeah. See you guys later though, Kendo. Peace out. By the way, if it's your favorite character, summon on him, who cares? It doesn't matter. It's what you wanted. Summon waste your crystals. If it's your favorite character, who gives a crap? Just summon if you want to.